Welcome to another random adventure at the Renaissance Fair. Every day at the Renaissance Fair, the big main event is the joust and battle reenactment. As you can see, people get really excited for some good old fashioned medieval violence. There are four competitors, each representing a different nation, such as France, Scotland, England, and Spain. Before each competitor enters the arena, their respective page hypes up the crowd or puts down the competitor. And the knights are brave. And in the spirit of good sportsmanship, everyone raise your voices for these, your tournament and champions. But as the sportsmanship does go, there still must be one who starts everything. Knights, who among you will call for the first match? England! The question always remains, who will he choose? Will it be Scotland? Not today, Scotland, but maybe France. Perhaps another time. That only leaves Spain. Now, we will be replacing these very sharp, pointy lances with breakaway lances. This may seem like an easy way to do it. However, I, I do assure you, it hurts no less. It just is a little less pointy. Now, as the knights ride past, they will try to break their lance upon the other's shield. However, the true point is to unhorse your opponent. We shall see how these things go. England, Spain, raise your voices for your champion, for they prepare to ride. The jousting is as real as it can get. The competitors come at each other at speed, and they do try to hit each other. Word with Saint Sands. Yeah! That is a broken lance for England. Seems Spain possibly has a response, but without a horse. Oh! To the spine! But after the realism of the joust, the hand-to-hand -hand combat is decidedly more WWE. Don't get me wrong, it's very exciting and entertaining, but it's clearly choreographed and predetermined. But it's all in good fun. Now folks, that is two broken lances, but I don't believe that fully settles it. What say you to some hand-to-hand -hand combat? Yeah! 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 Spain's up to
Personally, I'm a fan of Scotland, but in this performance, victory went to France. After the performance, there's an opportunity to pet the horses, which I always enjoy. I hope you enjoyed our time at the Renaissance Fair. Until the next random adventure, take care.